Hey guys, how are you? In this video, I'm going to talk about the Nokia 9 or the Nokia 9 Peer View. So, as we know, the handset has been the subject of speculations throughout 2018 with its pendulance camera setup. But all those speculations have so far proved to be elusive. And the latest leaks regarding the Nokia 9's release date suggest that it will launch in Dubai on 5th of December 2018 and Nokia X7 aka the Nokia 7.1 Plus is also expected to be revealed in this event and today's leaks are based upon the case renders that were posted on slash leaks by contributor Dimitri12 and if we take a look at these renders we can see there are a total of 7 holes on the back of the case. 5 for the cameras and apart from that one for the flash and the other one for the PDAF phase detection out of focus. Other details include two buttons on the right edge which are probably for the power and the volume, a cutout for a microphone on the top edge and for some people it is for the 3.5mm headphone jack and more holes for what's likely two speakers and a USB-C port on the bottom edge. And now let's move towards the specs. So as far as the display is concerned, it is a 5.9 inch AMOLED panel with 2060 by 1440p resolution with 76% of skin to body ratio and 18.5 by 9 aspect ratio. The pixel brain density of the screen of the Nokia 9 is 558 ppi. And for the protection, corning greater glass of unspecified version will be used. Now for the OS, so it will run on Android 9.0 Pi out of the box with Android 1. And the chipset that will be used for the Nokia 9 is Snapdragon 845 10nm octa-core processor with Adreno 630 GPU. So now let's move towards the memory. So the internal memory of the Nokia 9 is expected to be 128 gigs with 8 gigs of RAM and microSD supported up to 512 GB. And Nokia 9 is also expected to feature an under-display fingerprint scanner. And as far as battery is concerned, it is expected to feature a 4150 mAh of massive battery with USB Type-C reversible connector. Okay guys, that is all for today. Subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell notifications so that you can get notified about my future videos. I'll see you in my next video, but for now, let's call it a day.